Hey guys, another video today. This week we're looking at Thursday flips for week nine. Now I know Thursday flips week eight didn't perform great. A lot of that had to do with the road to the final promo. We actually do have another road to the final coming out on Friday, but I don't think it's gonna have as big of a market impact as we saw for the first week. So I have a list of eight different looks that we can look at for investment for Thursday flips this week. So let's get right into it. So as always, these looks are listed on the website. So you can see the eight different looks and their buy prices on the website. I'll also link them in the description if you're if you're on YouTube right now. But the eight different players that we have are Nelson Semedo, Inform Fabinho, Inform Wijnaldum, Ferland Mendy, Inform Werner, Lewandowski, Inform Nine Golan, and then finally Icons Under Average. So let's get into specifics about exactly why I like each of these players. So Nelson Semedo, right back, La Liga. Oftentimes, people turn to him because there's not a whole lot of options at right back in La Liga. And the other thing that's going for him this week is that there are a few new players on the market that people will potentially be getting. Of course, Messi from Team of the Week 9 came out today, so potentially could get him in rewards on Thursday, and people could look to surround Semedo with Messi. Another player that people probably will be turning to this week is not Semedo, of course. We're actually looking at Dembele. So Dembele, a road to the final player, you could also have that green link for Dembele to Semedo at right back. So looking at Semedo, target buy for him, I like 17K on Xbox, 25K on PS, PS4, and then PC 30K. So moving right along, the next player that I have listed is Inform Fabinho. So the same way that's, that Semedo had those links to Messi and then Dembele, you actually have links for F Fabinho for both the Road to the Final Mane, which just came out last week, Friday, and then of course, a Team of the Week 9 Robertson at left back. So I think people will be turning to some Liverpool squads this week. Target buy for him, we're looking at 200K on Xbox, 200K on PS4 as well, and then 205K on PC. Moving down the list, number three, a fellow uh, Liverpool player actually is Wijnaldum. Now, Wijnaldum actually for the exact same reasons as Inform Fabinho, I like him this week because he does pair up with that road to the final uh, Mane and then also that left back Robertson if in case people pack him in their rewards on Thursday. So target buy for him, let's look at 155K on Xbox, 165K on PS4, and then on PC 185K. Okay, moving back to La Liga now, the next player on the list is Ferland Mendy. Now, Ferland Mendy, interestingly enough, performed pretty well even throughout the market crash last week, so he actually held his price fairly well. He's dipped considerably since on Saturday and Sunday and Monday, but um, right now he's kind of leveling off, and he's performed well in past Thursday flips. Another reason that I think he potentially could be turned to a little more this week is because of his link with Road to the Final Militao as well. So he has that Real Madrid green link going across. So target buy for him, I would look at 25K on Xbox, 35K on PS4, and then on PC, let's look at 42K. Number five, looking at Inform Werner. Now, Inform Werner was in Team of the Week 8, and he's probably about at his bottom at this point. I think a lot of people in the coming days will look to build Bundesliga squads for a few reasons. One of them is that Serge Gnabry is probably going to have a uh, Bundesliga player of the month coming out and you have that strong link with Gnabry for Werner. They're both German, both from the Bundesliga, so I think he's a good look there. Also, you not a, not a green link, but a yellow link to Kingsley Coleman, another road to the final card, who people are probably going to start trying to incorporate in their squads, so you could look there for investment as well. Target buy price for him, 180k on Xbox, 190k on PS4, and then 210k on PC. Next up, kind of for the same reasoning, we have Lewandowski. Now, what Lewandowski has on his side is the fact that he is out of packs. So Lewandowski in Team of the Week 9, he's out of packs. He has that Bayern connection, actually, with Canabry for, for a potential player of the month that could be coming out on Thursday or Friday, and also has the Bayern connection with Kingsley Coleman, another road to the final player. So I think he's a nice look as well. Target buy price for him, let's look at 34k on Xbox, 34k on PS4, and 47k on PC. Okay, last player that we're going to look at, number seven, is Nine Golan. Now, oops. Let's pull that one up again. I think I just X'd out of the X'd out of the um, 
the player. But so we have 85 9 Golan that we can look at. He's actually been panic sold um, a little bit because he had a second inform come out today, a cam inform. So that's oftentimes what you see happen with players when they get a, a second inform, their their first inform de decreases in price. Same thing when you have a third inform come out, their second inform and first inform decrease in price. So that's oftentimes what happens. This past weekend, this past Thursday, he was up around 130 cam PC 106 on PS4 and 98 on Xbox, and he's almost. Almost, probably went down about 40% in price at this point, down to 67k at the moment, 64k and 67k on PC. So a target buy price that I like for him is 60k on Xbox, 65k on PS4, and 70k on PC. So I think you can probably get him for those prices if you look to snipe or just get in on those optimal times. The last player or grouping of players that I should say that we have is icons under average. Now I've been flipping icons Wednesdays going into Thursdays. In FIFA 19, FIFA 20, it's been a really successful thing as well because icons always increase as people incorporate them into their squads following weekend league and division rivals rewards. If you look at each Wednesday going into Thursday from this FIFA, you had uh, an increase here, 88 to 90 here. This, by the way, this is the index icon market on on bin. So you can look individually at each of those days going into the next day. Wednesday going into Thursday here, 90.36 up to 95. We had Wednesday to Thursday here, 92 to 98, 91 to 95 here, 91 to 95 here. And then this past week, even in a down market when a lot of stuff fell from the road to the final crash, you still had an increase from 94 to 98 and then a substantial decrease that, that followed after. So I think, again, we're going to have a Wednesday to Thursday increase for icons under average. So those are the things, those are the things you can target there as well. So... Thanks guys for watching. Good luck with this investment and hopefully our Thursday flips work out a little better this week than they did last week. So good luck and take care.